Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Upcut Media back with another Dokkan Battle video. And in today's video, we are going to be showcasing the highly anticipated Extreme Z Awakening for the AGL Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku. Now before we jump into the gameplay and take a look at what this guy can do, I'm going to quickly go over the details for his Extreme Z Awakening. So for anybody that already knows exactly what he's all about, you can feel free to skip ahead to the gameplay. I'll put a timestamp somewhere above my head over here. And without further ado guys, let's jump in. Starting with his leader skill, he gives AGL types key plus 3, HP, attack and defense plus 120%, and his super attack is 10 times Kaioken God Kamehameha, which greatly raises attack and causes immense damage while sacrificing 5% HP. Now, one very key thing to note about this super attack is that the greatly raises attack part, the buff, is infinite and it stacks every single time it's used. So essentially, after a few turns, after a few supers, this guy is going to be outputting some absolutely ridiculous numbers, as I'm sure you'll see in just a second. And his passive is attack and defense plus 59%, plus an additional attack and defense plus 59% for 10 turns from start of turn, and also attack plus 59% and performs a critical hit after the 9th turn from start of battle once only. And his links are Super Saiyan, Warrior Gods, Kamehameha, Prepare for Battle, Over in a Flash, Shocking Speed, and Fierce Battle, and that right there is an absolutely top tier link set. I gotta say, probably one of the best in the game. And his categories are Realm of Gods, Pure Saiyans, Full Power, Representatives of Universe 7, Goku's Family, Kamehameha, and Master Student Bond. So that right there, guys, is the new and improved AGL Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku. And without further ado, let's dive into the gameplay and see what this guy can do, how well he can perform on this Goku's family team I've set up here. And we actually have the perfect first rotation because he ended up with his best linking partner, which is the AGL Super Saiyan God Goku. They share a total of six links for, I believe, 35% attack and something like five keys. So they basically auto super for each other. And we also have the support from the Int Goku. And I believe his defense is 102,696, which is very respectable. So let's see what happens, guys. Now, not only am I interested to see how hard he can hit, but look, that tanking is pretty good too. That tanking is pretty good. The damage <laughs> is even better. Oh my god. Are you freaking kidding me? I, I was talking about the defense, but, but then I'm like, why am I talking about defense? Who cares about defense right now? This man just got 2.7 million attack on the first turn, on his first attack. Okay, so that's how this showcase is going to go. Okay, I see. Um, <laughs> are you freaking kidding me, man? That is, uh, that is nuts. I was expecting a lot from this unit. I was expecting a lot from this EZA. I knew this was going to be a good showcase, but I was not expecting that. All right, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be straight up with you guys. I was not expecting that much damage from the outset. I thought maybe after a couple turns of stacking that crazy attack, that greatly raise uh, attack on the super, you know, we'd be over two million, three million, something like that. But almost three million on the first turn? Nah, man, I was not expecting that. <laughs> That's just wild, man. That's silly. You know that is those that number is silly. That's not a word I use lightly, but that's the only word to describe what we just saw there. That was silly, all right? <laughs> that's crazy, I love it, man, I love it. Okay, second turn, we still have a support on rotation and we actually have a better support because this guy gives 35%. Um, as you can see, we have 11 key. So, I mean, I know that the AGL Super Saiyan God Goku is not the most exciting unit, but if you want the best partner for him, uh, for the Kaioken Goku that is, then this AGL Goku is it, man. This AGL Kaioken Goku, or sorry, Super Saiyan God Goku is it. Okay, so I need to stop talking over the damage. Uh, <laughs> we just went over 3 million. Second turn. Second turn of the showcase, second turn of this event, over 3 million. And the AGL Super Saiyan God Goku, I think he heard me saying that he's not amazing because he's showing out right now. And honestly, that damage is pretty respectable, man. That damage is very, very good. Look, like, he's a very old unit. 
without a Shrimsy Awakening, and he just did pretty much 1.5 mil for two supers back to back. That's not bad. That's really not bad. Okay, so I'm gonna try to get these guys to not super too much um, whenever possible because I do want to keep the focus on the Kaioken Goku. I mean, either way, Super Saiyan 4 Goku is gonna show out a little bit because it's Super Saiyan 4 Goku, but we're gonna limit his uh, his damage output as much as possible. Oh man, that, that's that's crazy though. That. <laughs> It's been a long day. Uh, it's been a busy day. I haven't really had a lot of time to play around with this guy before the showcase. I pretty much just uh, got home from what I was doing outside and started the video. And, you know, I, I, that's why I didn't really know what to expect, man. I didn't really know what to, what kind of damage he was going to do. I didn't really have time to watch other people's showcases. Maybe if I did that, then I wouldn't be as surprised right now. But I honestly think it's better this way. I'm being real, it's probably better this way just because you guys got my genuine reaction to those numbers, man, and <laughs> it's just silly, it's just silly. So obviously, like I said, we're not supering with the Goku here, the, the Super Saiyan 4 Goku that is. I keep saying Goku, but they're all Gokus, right? Alright, so 2.7 million without support, and then 2.9 with the additional. Yeah, okay. <laughs> This guy doesn't need support, he's his own support, man. <laughs> Seriously though, he's his own support. He raises his own attack every single time he supers infinitely. So in this event, I'm gonna try my best to get to nine turns so we can get that additional uh, guaranteed crit on the ninth turn, but I don't even think it's possible, honestly. Like, we're doing so much damage here. I mean, it's a good thing that the boo does heal up, but once he gets to his final form, oh crap. See, <sighs> no, I, I, I would reset it here, but I'm not going to, but it's just so hard to not let Super Saiyan 4 Goku get his 18 key super, you know? But uh, yeah, I mean, uh, oh, I totally forgot what I was going to say now. I'm too excited. There's there's too much stuff going on right now. Um, Kaoken Goku's crazy. He is his own support. I think that's what I said. Super Saiyan 4 Goku is, is, is wild too. Uh, yeah, what was I on, man? What was I even talking about? I don't really know. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Oh, uh, once the Boo gets to the final stage of his transformation in this event, um, he's gonna be pretty squishy. He's not gonna be. He's not gonna be nearly as tanky as he is right now. So, I mean, we might actually finish him off in one turn if the Kaioken Goku gets an additional, which will kind of suck, honestly, because I do want him to attack a little bit more. But what can you do? What can you do? He's just too good. He's too strong. All right. Kaioken Goku is back. I think Super Buu is now in his final form. Yes, he is, unfortunately. But let's see what this attack's at right now. Um, 849,267 before any orbs. Defense is 110,978. Very, very respectable. Um, so, you know, while he's not the best tank, he's not like... He's no Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, I'll say that. He's no Golden Frieza, anything like that. But... He is still very, very good in his own right, and um, a respectable tank, I'll say that. A respectable tank. Alright. What's this gonna do? 3.8 million. Okay. Casual. Casual, not bad. <laughs> Almost 4 million, guys. Almost 4 million. Now, I do want to attack one more time with the Kaioken Goku, but I don't think I'll be able to, because... Yeah, no, there's no way. Even if we get only normal attacks, uh, which is going to be tough. Actually, we can, but even if we get only normal attacks, we're still going to kill the Boo anyway. So, uh, let's see. Why don't we do this? Why don't we do this? Um, let me turn up the volume a little bit. So, volume's up, and we are going to actually launch the active skill for Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Get it off. <laughs> <sighs> All right, so that is how you end the showcase, guys. And that is the showcase for the AGL Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku Extremes the Awakening. He is absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely dumb, just like how hard he hits. And of course, he does cost you some... Uh, HP when he supers, but I mean, you gotta offset the damage output somehow, right? And even so, it's not necessarily even always a bad thing to 
uh, lose HP because think about him on a like a Kamehameha team where you want to get the transformation off with the Gohan, right? In that case, it's actually a very good thing that you're losing HP every super. And also for the STR Namek transforming Goku, he needs to lose HP too to transform. So overall, it's not the worst thing. You're probably not going to be bringing the Kaioken Goku onto Super Battle Road or anything like that because you really can't afford to lose all that HP. But on any mode where you're not too worried about your HP, um, he's going to be great. So there you go, guys. That is the Extreme Z Awakening for the ADL Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku. I've, I've said that so many times now. Um, and he's coming soon, very, very soon to JP. I think within the next five to six days, less than a week. And for Global, who really knows? I don't think anybody really knows. I don't think Bandai even knows what the release schedule for EZAs are uh, on Global. So uh, we'll have to wait and see. We'll have to wait and see. But I can't wait for him to drop. He is just ridiculous. And I hope you guys enjoyed today's showcase. Let me know in the comments down below what you think about this unit. And as always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.